welcome children today in evs2 we are going to learn about swaraj first conquest it is no doubt true that shivaji and his comrades took the oath of swaraj in the temple of raiveshwar but it was a very difficult task in those days maharashtra was governed by four different powers the mogul emperor of delhi sultan adil shah of bijapur the portuguese of goa and the city of janjira they were powerful opponents firm in their authority torna fort shivaji controlled the jagir of pune supe sakarn and indapur a hill fort gave strategic support to the ruler and shivaji decided to capture one at a suitable time for this purpose he had selected the fort of torna it stands to the southwest of pune in the kannad valley it was a renowned fort well suited for defense there were two strong marches on the way to the fort a marchi is a fortification of a natural plateau formed on the slope of a hill one of these marches was the zunzar marchi and the other the budhala marchi zunzar marchi like its name could offer powerful defense torna was considered one of the strong forts of maharashtra in the fort there is a temple of the goddess toranzai that is why the fort is called torna the drums of swaraj began to sound with a few select bands of mavla shivaji descended into the kannad valley tanaji malusare hoisted the maratha flag the fort was captured the sky was filled with the shouts of shivaji maharaj ki jai shivaji named this fort prachangad blessings of goddess bhavani as repairs to the fort started a surprise awaited the people they discovered four metal pots filled with mohars the first capital of swaraj the money found of torna the money found on torna was used to complete the fortification of muram dev shivaji named this fort rajgarh rajgarh became the first capital of swaraj shivaji's rapid progress from then onwards shivaji moved swiftly and captured one fort after an another in marvel shivaji the shrewd politician adil shah was more surprised to get the news he asked shahaji raje for an explanation shahaji raje got himself outside of this difficult situation by telling the sultan that shivaji raje had probably probably sorry shahaji raje got himself out of this situation shahaji raje got himself out of this difficult situation by telling the sultan that shivaji raje had probably taken over the fort for better administration of the jagir thank you